The Douglas County prosecutor says the deadly force used by an Omaha police officer last week was legal. A grand jury will still make a decision on if charges will be brought forward. This stems from the deadly shooting of 37-year-old Cameron Ford during a no-knock search warrant for a nar narcotics investigation. We have live team coverage at 4 today. KETV Newswatch 7's Waverly Monroe has reaction from a representative of the Ford family. But we begin this afternoon with Alex McLoone. He's live outside the Douglas County courthouse with the latest on the investigation. Bill Quinesia, Officer Adam Vale is reassigned to a desk job while the county attorney turns evidence over to a grand jury. Today, Douglas County Attorney Don Klein announcing Officer Vale's use of deadly force was legal based on still images and audio from Officer Vale's body camera, which shows the officer announce himself at least five times while proceeding through Cameron Ford's home. But body cam video of the shooting is blocked by Vale's own ballistic shield because he was in a narrow hallway. The county attorney also basing his decision on the suspect's criminal history that was gang involved and the officer's statement after the shooting. In Vale's statement, he said Ford charged out of the room. Vale was unable to see Ford's hands and Vale feared he and his fellow officers were in a life threatening situation. There were there were things that he reasonably believed that why would a person who's hearing a scream police officers wouldn't come out with his hands up, wouldn't comply, and instead charge at him. So he fired the one shot in fear for his life and his fellow officers at the time that this shot was fired. That their, cons their statements were consistent with Vail's. Bill, back to you.